Recently, I needed to visit the Air Force Institute of Technology, AFIT. That is located on Wright-Patterson Air Force Base, just north of Dayton, Ohio. After that, I took the next morning and visited the National Museum of the United States Air Force. This museum is the oldest and largest military aviation museum in the world with more than 360 aircraft and missiles on display. My mother would take me here growing up. I've probably been here a dozen or more times throughout my life, and whenever I'm going through the area, I try to stop because this is a really true gem that this country has for us. It's free, and it's been closed due to the pandemic, and it's now that it's open, and I'll be visiting Dayton a lot, I wanted to visit it and really take in all the scenes here. These early shots are in the morning before the doors opened. So what this video is, is a t visual tour of the early years hangar. There's so much, there's four hangars. And what I'm gonna do is put the title of the plane and then down in the description below, there's gonna be a link because the Air Force Museum has a great website with a page for each airplane and a lot of additional high res pictures. So I'm gonna stop talking, let you enjoy the early years hangar at the National Museum of the United States Air Force.
All right, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed some of the way I see these airplanes. And we will be back sometime soon for the World War II hangar. There's a ton of airplanes in there. I already took a lot of video, especially of that Tan Zero, my favorite plane there. But guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. I know you see the pictures of these planes, but I was there. I wanted to take some video of what it looks like in the hangar so you guys can enjoy these awesome airplanes. So, see you guys next time.